Right, what is up? So, we got a match here. I'm Captain Falcon against Kirby. Um, I don't like facing Kirby. <laughs> Kirby really bothers me. Um, but anyways, so yeah, Falcon, Dreamland, on Project 64 as usual. Get a grab. Nice DI there, I think. I didn't quite catch it, because... Movie Maker lagged, but I'm pretty sure he had nice DI to the right there, so I couldn't follow up that well. And I shouldn't have done no smash, I should have up aired, then I could have done more combo stuff. Made the read, didn't quite hit him. Uh, yeah, don't really know what to make of that. I should have nared there, probably, instead of up air, but he does a very random up B, so. <clears throat> so, what you don't want to do is what he's doing. <laughs> um, the random sucking up is not really all that great. Follow up, follow up, follow up, B. Nice. Um, solid stuff. Um, Kirby is somewhat easy to combo as Falcon, which is nice. Um, Kirby also, however, like destroys Falcon's edge game, like uh, returning, because that, for example, and his spike. But uh, yeah, if, if a Kirby gets Falcon off the stage, the Falcon should be dead. It's it's pretty much all there is to it. And even then, sometimes it's dangerous for Falcon edge guard Kirby because of the up B and his spike. Um, when I jumped up out there to get the uh, stomp, that was pretty dangerous because he could have came from the top and spiked me down. But uh, so all these crazy dash attacks, which are just not smart. Um, and I'm messing up my punish there by doing a full jump when I should be doing a short jump. Um, but he's not going to make it back, um, so doing pretty well right now. <laughs> um, a lot of the things I would say is that this person needs to not smash attack so much, um, and definitely try to use your aerials more, um, and he's, he's been using the up, uh, the up air a lot. Which for Kirby is not very good in this game. Well, I mean, it's not really good in any game, but that was kind of gutsy. I don't want to say gutsy because I'm way ahead, but I always would like to try to get a combo like that, but sometimes I mess up. I Fat Falcon Punch combos are so cool, but uh, I toss out around a random Falcon Punch there at the end, and he was rolling back and forth for some reason, so it caught him. But, uh, we're going to the next one here. It's, um, a Ness vs. Fox. I'm the Ness. Um, yeah, this Fox, if it's the person I think it is, um, that, that right there just shows what, basically, what I think of <laughs> this whole ex few exchange within the first bit. He does a lot of random smash attacks like that, and, uh, dash attacks as well. And it's something that I'm not. It, it's not necessarily dumb, but it's not It's not what I would consider a smart play. So <laughs> I'm just not used to it because I'm used to people doing like safer things. So he he'll end up catching me quite a bit, I believe, with weird dash attacks and smash attack type things. Um, and he, yeah, okay, I got that one. Um, sometimes, I guess, oh, that would have been nice if I had landed on the edge, I could have got a grab after, but, I don't remember what I was going to talk about before that, though. Bait the up smash, because I remember him doing that the last time I played, and he, yeah, he gets unlucky because the wind and stuff, I think, or he falls off, so I decided to kill myself as well, because, eh, why not? It's friendlies, quote unquote, so, it's not like it matters that much. Um, okay, up tilt, up tilt, up tilt. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, I was about to say, three up tilts is usually too much for the platform right there. Um, almost got the tech chase read there. Um, Nair out of shield is something that appears to be working decently for me against this fox. I would ne wouldn't necessarily say that works against most fox. And right there, I just barely missed the grab because I missed his roll. I misspaced his roll. Okay. I don't know why I did back air there. He should have done either another up air or a neutral air or forward air to hit me off the stage more. Because a back air what isn't really going to do that much unless I'm higher. And he hits me with the hard hitting spot. Which he 
or didn't at all, so. Um, something that is kind of visible in this is that I I noticed a few times I I used my forward air um, to, to as just like a move to combat against him, but all of his aerials pretty much outspace it. Like his forward air and his back air are probably better hitboxes than my forward air, but I don't know. I'll, I'll try to point it out next time I see it. Ooh, I missed miss time that jump. Okay. I'm, I'm kind of harassing him. I'm getting, I'm chasing him down quite a bit. Um, random up smash. I'm, I'm not sure if that was supposed to be a forward tilt. I mean, an up tilt or what? But he's gonna get the simple punish there. That was nice and easy, smart. Um, no reason to go for fancy stuff. I mean, fancy stuff is awesome, but. Eh, sometimes you just gotta do the what you gotta do. And that right there is taunt canceling if you don't know what that is. Um, with the wind. When the wind is blowing you can do that. Simple edge guard there. Nothing really too significant. Um, don't really know why I jumped off the edge there, but uh, okay, random smash attack, dash attack. <laughs> when you see me do a grab and then turn immediately, that usually means I'm so confident that I thought I got the grab. I was so confident in the grab that I thought I got it, but uh, he messes up his uppy recovery, and that's the game. Short one, but catch you next time.